My name is Drew Hiles. I'm 22 years old. I'm currently located in Central Ohio. Um, I have my degree in web page design, but it's not my main interest at the moment. Um, I kind of have my foot in a few different doors as to what I want to do. Um, I really have a big interest in graphic design, photography, videography. I love to play music, write music. Um, I've always been interested in becoming an actor or a comedian. And it's always been a struggle figuring out that one thing that I really wanted to do. Um, my whole life I always thought what I needed to do was get out of Ohio and really, you know, surround myself with a big place, a big city, uh, you know, a bunch of people and more job opportunities. I felt like if I moved away that everything would just click, everything would come together and I could live my life how I wanted to live. But it was actually completely different. It, moving out of state and moving to Colorado was, was a really big eye-opener for me. It was, um, really put a lot of things in perspective. Um, it's really not about where you live or you know where you move. It's just really what you're doing. It's where your head's at. Um, it's what you're focused on and what you really love. And that's, that's one thing I've always been worried about when I was growing up and trying to go to college and I just didn't know what I wanted to go for. And it seems like that's what everybody's so focused on is, you know, what they're going to do and figuring out what they're, what they're going to be for the rest of their life and, you know, find that one thing that they're really accelerated at and really focused on. Sometimes I just think that I'll just be walking down the road and somebody will come up to me and be like, hey, you want this career that you've wanted for the rest, you know, for all of your life and it's going to be perfect and you love it? And I'm just going to be like, yes, that's exactly what I want. Awesome. Thank you. But you can't just wait for that day to come for somebody to just hand you something. You just, you have to work for it and you have to want it and you have to love it. I've always been, you know, an option kind of guy, even when it comes to getting coffee, I'll, you know, get, you know, some Colombian, some house roast, some dark roast, uh, throw a little bit of cappuccino, some sugar, some creamer, a little bit of everything. And I think that really says a lot about my personality. I'm sort of at a crossroads in my life, trying to figure out if I need to go back to school or just get a full-time job or, you know, do a combination of the both. And that's what, that's what it seems like everybody's worried about. A lot of people are just trying to find a, a good full-time job that they can get secure with, you know, for the rest of their life and just work a clock in, clocked out job forever. And that's that's not me, that's not who I am. And that's not what I want to do for the rest of my life. I I want my career to be what I love to do. All my all my friends growing up, you know, since they were young, just have this one thing that they were just really focused on and really great at, you know, whether it was a musician, a photographer, you know, any, anything really. But I've, I've always, you know, I've always compared myself to others and my friends as well. And it's not a good thing to do. It's a really negative thought to compare yourself to everybody else. Everybody's life is different. Everybody has been on a different path and everybody has done things completely different way. So you can't put yourself in the same category as everybody else. You gotta focus on your life, and what you're doing and where you're at, not what everybody else is doing. And it's, it's hard to focus on that one thing and figure out what you wanna do. It's, it's a struggle, but I just, I just really want to be happy with what I'm doing. I want to wake up every day and have a job to where it's not even a job to me. It's just getting up and do what I love to do because I love to do it. And I feel like that's what everybody should do. Find, find that one thing that you really, 